collection of hollows. My life is complete. I can now die. Goodbye. Just kidding. Gotta stick around to enjoy the porn. Introducing the Simply Neological Fun Lacquer Collection. Six polishes, three colors, and two finishes. It's available now online at an internet computer machine near you. I put some links down below in the video description box, and this is an infomercial. Yes, it is. That's what it's starting to sound like, Christine. But oh my god, so much hollow, I don't even know where to begin. I'm gonna show you guys some video swatches of all of these polishes, and I'll let you in on my little secret on how to make these polishes super opaque and super hollow glittery. Stay tuned until the end of this video for that. Let's break it down now. We got three colors, pink, blue, and black. They're all 100% holographic glitters in a clear base. And each of them has a hollow twin, meaning that on top of the colored holographic glitter, there's also the traditional silver holographic pigment within the hollow glitter. So it's like double the hollow. That's what the extra H in brackets beside the name of these polishes mean. It means H for extra hollow. But they're all hollow, don't be mistaken about that. Personally, I think either finish is freaking gorgeous. It's just completely dependent on personal preference and what kind of look you're feeling. And if you can't decide, you could just get the whole set. There will be some special discount offers on the day of release, so make sure you check the video description box to see what deals are going on now. All right, let's get into it, yeah. Up first is Hollow Queen, named after me, obviously. Joking, joking, everyone, calm down. It's named after any magical creature who puts the super vivid and vibrant pinkish purple magenta hollow glitter on their nails. They instantly become a Hollow Queen. For my choice of color, I was inspired by the middle line between pink and purple. I really like the middle of pink and purple for some reason. And to be honest, I've never seen this saturated of a hollow glitter in a nail polish before. Sure, companies will make the jelly part of the nail polish, like the base of the nail polish, this type of hue, but I've never seen it in a hollow glitter itself before. FYI, all of my swatches are sponged on with two coats of glossy top coat. I'll show you how I did that at the end of this video. How did I not even mention the boxes yet? With every polish from this collection comes a holographic box. So even if you don't like nail polish, you can buy it just for the box. I know you're out there. I see you. Next up, Hollow Queen H. That means with extra hollow pigment. So as you can see, it makes the polish look a little more silvery, but it is the exact same magenta pinky purple hollow glitters, it's just got a crap load of extra hollow added into it. If you didn't know, Fun Lacquer is very well known for her holographic glitters. She is one of my favorite brands who make these, that is why I entrusted this sacred mission to her. And she will often do a regular hollow glitter plus the added H version of the same hollow glitter, and I think it's a really cool concept and so I wanted to continue Continue that tradition. The next polish is one that we should be singing to. Anyone remember this video? How deep is your hollow? Is it like the ocean? Rainbow in motion? Oh, cringe, my voice is so great. Yeah. By the way, have you seen my music video? I have, for a long time, wanted a super pigmented, vibrant, royal cobalt blue in a holographic glitter. And I knew exactly what to name it after that stupid song I started singing. It's kind of a rhetorical question. How deep is your hollow? Is it like the ocean? Of course it's like the ocean. I mean, look at it. It's the prettiest f ocean you've ever seen. Hey, you wanna come over later? I'm having a pool party on my nails. And oh, look. Menchie here, of course. Menchie, you are everywhere. Can't film a video without her. 
Now it's time to say holo to how deep is your holo 8 version. Even though I really like the blue just by itself because the color is so awesome and bright. I think the 8 version is so pretty and gorgeous because it really gives it way more rainbows. And yeah, I like rainbows. The added holo pigments do make the blue color appear a bit lighter, eh? It's kind of cool how that works. But at the same time, it's very three-dimensional. Like, I mean, obviously my nails are 3D. But you know what I mean, right? There's a lot of depth to this polish. I've saved my most prized possession for last. Introducing Black Hollow Witch. You heard me, I actually named it after a witch. When I say the term witch on this channel, I mean it as a compliment. I mean it as something that represents magic. And to me, this 100% black holographic glitter is both dark and edgy and enchanting, but at the same time, it's magical and captivating because you can see so many rainbows. Now, true story, I have been in search of black holographic glitter in a nail polish for centuries. It's actually so rare that I've never seen one like this before. Most polishes you think are black hollow glitter are usually just silver hollow glitter and a black jelly base. There is a difference. Throw back to this video. I have yet to find black hollow glitter in its purest nail polish form, but I will never give up my search. Never. One day I will find you. And so, several months ago, I enlisted the help of Fun Lacquer to complete my life goals by realizing my dream of a true black holographic glitter nail polish. And she delivered on her quest. Some may try to replicate it, but you just can't beat the original black hollow witch. A witch of which I consider my hollow child. Please take good care of her if you adopt my children. And to round out the collection, we've got the extra hollow twin of Black Hollow Witch. Black Hollow Glitter is already so rainbowy because hollows reflect best with black. So you got a Black Hollow Glitter with extra hollow on top of that, so the extra hollow reflects off the Black Hollow Glitter, making it all the more rainbow. Oh my god, it's just so much to take in, I know. Okay, now that I've showed you these amazing holographic polishes and you've already added all of them to your online shopping cart and clicked buy now, let me show you how to apply them so they look on your Nails like how they look on my nails. First up, I always, 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 always start off with a peel off base coat. No, you don't need a peel off base coat to have the glitter look cool on your nails, but it makes it a hell of a lot easier to get off your nails. You're gonna start applying the glitter polish with just one thin coat on your nail to make your nail a little bit sticky. Don't worry if it's just a little bit of glitter on your nail right now, you actually don't wanna make it all thick and gloopy because the next step is sponging on the glitters, which is gonna make it opaque. Apply the polish to a latex free makeup sponge and sponge it directly onto your nail. This way, some of the clear jelly from the polish actually absorbs into the sponge and leaves more glitter goodies behind on your nail. You could do this two ways. You can work with a small corner of the sponge in small sections like I'm doing. Or if you're feeling a little messy, you can just apply a liquid latex barrier around your nail and sponge it on that way and then peel it off. After you've covered up all the nail, you can add one more thin coat of the glitter if you like and then seal all that glitter goodness in with a thick glossy top coat or a glossy taco, depending on how I pronounce things. When I use super glitter, filled polishes like these, I often add a second glossy top coat. This helps create more of a smooth finish. And in case you were wondering, you can use the exact same sponging method for the hollow twin version of each of these polishes. I've been sponging on glitters since I was a fetus. I never put on glitter polish any other way, to be honest. In my books, this is the only way to apply glitter nail polish. And when you're done, since you were responsible and put on a peel off base coat, you can peel that glitter right off your nail. Mm. Heel porn. It's almost as good as nail porn, but not quite as good. And that's my collection. Leave a comment and let me know what you think. And oh, hello, Menchie. My cat is here to visit. No matter what I do, I just can't keep her away from the hollow. She came out to me one day as hollow sexual, and I was very accepting. Oh, mom, look at these pretty hollows. Oh, I'm distracted by this hollow paper. Oh, hollow polish. Oh, hollow paper. Help, I can't make up my mind. I'm a cat. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching, and thank you for your support for bringing me to a place where I could actually have my own holographic nail polish collection. What? Don't forget to tag me on social media with hashtag funlacker simply nailogical so I can come see all your hollow creations. And just remember, if anyone is hating on you for your hollow sexuality, can't see the haters blinded by the hollow.